Amongst everything that can make or break a rally team weekend, tyres play an important part. Dean Herridge is at the start of SS15 Ellis, checking the difference in tyre wear between two and four wheel drive. Here's Mick Patton, he's leading four wheel drive. See the lead edge here and the outside corner that does all the work. What we want to do is now compare to a leading front wheel drive car, so a four wheel drive car, more efficient, driving through all four wheels, less wear than a high revving two wheel drive. Let's have a look at Molly Taylor who won yesterday and see what her car looks like. So unlike Mick Patton, this is Molly Taylor's Renault, front wheel drive only. Look at the extra wear, particularly in the centre, so the drive and the brake part of the, the blocks here is way more worn. The edge on both tyres are worn where you're turning. So this car, all the work is being done by the front, the rear is effectively following. Not quite an efficient way to work the tyres through. The difficulty for the teams, both four wheel drive and two wheel drive in this category, is you've got 16 for this round. How to manage them and get the most efficiency work out of them, it all comes down to strategy.